So today I'm going to be talking about what everybody's been talking about and it's the professional by, not the professional, the Maybelline Baby Skin, this one right here. And my, I was having a hard time look, finding this in all stores, but my friend from work, my comadre Fabiola, she bought it for me and thank you so much for finding it for me. And supposedly it's supposed to be a dupe for, for the baby, uh, the professional. I've been using this for a couple of years and I really like it just because I have a lot of pores on my nose as well as um, in this area right here. And it does cover up really, really good. Although it is $30, it will last you a long time, so it's well worth the price. If you guys want to see what it looks like on my face, just continue to watch. So I haven't even opened it yet. It's still in the packaging, so let's open it up right now. In similarity, I guess they were trying to make it look like the professional a little. They look like the same color. Um... I think my legs like washing it out. Let's see what it actually looks like. Oh, it's clear. It's a clear, like. And the professional has like a tint to it, which is what I like. Which is right there. That's the professional, that's the baby skin. Oh, since I did see it was a clear, like silicone-y um, pore filler, it does remind me of the Tarte Amazonian uh, primer, and the one in the purple, this is just a small um, sample I have. And you guys can see, like, I'll squeeze it up. They have a more similar consistency, out of the, straight out of the tube. This one's the poor the tart one. This one's the baby skin, and this one's a professional. So let's just see how the baby skin goes on. I hope it does cover up my little holes I have on my face. So let's see. I have absolutely no makeup, on, no face makeup on right now. You guys can see that I have nothing. I have like a little red thing right there. Like my skin just looks terrible right now. But. Let's see of this baby skin. I'm taking that much. That's how much I'm taking and I'm just gonna smooth it over and then let's see. Now for pore fillers, you do want to pat them in. You don't want to rub them in. That's the point of the um, uh, pore filler. It just you usually pat it into your skin. That's how it fills um, your pores up. But okay, let's see if there's a difference. I feel like it did fill in my pores a little bit, but I can't see because there's like a super bright light right in front of me. But my skin feels a little bit on the oily side. So far, the Baby skin does feel a little bit greasy and that's not a good thing because we, we want our foundation to stick. I'm like blinded by the light. I still see my pores. I still see my pores like coming out so I'm not gonna say it's a great product but and it's not an instant pore eraser maybe because I have huge pores I don't know but I would still stick to my Professional. I don't think they're the same thing. Everyone's saying they're the same thing, but they're not. It's closer to the Tarte one. But so far, I mean, it did leave my skin really soft to where I put it. It does feel a little bit greasy, but let's see what it looks like with makeup on. Maybe it'll look better or worse. So I'm back, and this is what it looks like with makeup on. Um... It doesn't look terrible, just, I don't know. I'm not gonna say I hate it because uh, it's just not gonna live up to the professional. It's more like the Tarte um, primer, the one I showed you guys earlier. It's more like this. This one, it's the small one, this is the small travel size. But I'm, 
it's a good consistency it's not too thick so it's not gonna clog up your pores and give you like pimples and clog up and make y'all nasty it's okay it's not the best primer but it's not the worst there's worse ones out there that I've tried that it's just like grease all over your face and they don't do nothing and they just break up your makeup so this is a good buy it's only $6.99 in most places it's probably like between five to seven dollars so it's not bad at all you get a, a good amount of product sorry I cannot see how these lights are blinding me right now I gotta figure out a way to make it like less bright like hello I cannot see I'm going blind if you guys want to go try it out try it out tell me if you guys like it or not I did see a lot of people talking about it, so I wanted to see what the hype was about. Even though it was a little bit hard to find, I think it's in most drugstores now, and at Ulta, and at Target, and at Walmart. Walmart. So you guys should be able to find it almost anywhere. And if you guys have any other first impressions you want me to do, just leave it in the comments below, and I will tr try to do my best to get it out there for y'all. Okay? So, until the next video.